We're now going to begin our discussion of civil procedure by taking a look at how you commence a lawsuit. Uh, that'll be our first section. Um, in commencing your lawsuit, the first thing you're going to, going to want to consider is which uh, judicial system are you going to be involving yourself in. Um, in the United States, there are any number of judicial courts that you could bring your case in. Uh, there, there are municipal courts, county courts, uh, state courts, federal courts. The two kind of courts we're going to take a look at are state courts in general and then the federal courts. Obviously, the, uh, uh, the main thrust of our examination of civil procedure is going to deal with uh, the federal courts and the federal rules of civil procedure as they relate to bringing the case in those federal courts. Um, but we want to take a look at uh, uh, both, both these sets to give you an idea about how their similarities and their differences. Um, state, uh, first thing we're going to look at is state judicial systems. State judicial systems typically include a variety of courts of limited subject matter jurisdiction authorized to hear specific types of cases such as traffic courts, landlord tenant courts, small claims courts, probate courts, or others. Um, and they also include a court of original and general jurisdiction that hears all claims that aren't exclusively vested in, in one of these other different courts of limited jurisdiction. Most state courts of general jurisdiction also possess uh, appellate jurisdiction over cases originally tried in courts of limited jurisdiction, which means what, what they'll do is they'll be able to review the courts, uh, the cases that are, uh, that are brought in, in, the, in, the, in the usually lower courts, such as the district courts and the small claims courts and so on. Appellate review in such cases is usually uh, de novo, which means that there is little or no deference paid to the lower court's decision because, uh, because of restrictions on its jurisdiction and in many cases uh, on its procedures. <clears throat> there, in the state system, there's usually an intermediate appellate layer uh, it's generally available in, in more populous states. Um, some states uh, skip this intermediate level and just go straight on to the Supreme Court of Appeals. Um, and a court of appeals, uh, and there's a court of appellate jurisdiction. Uh, it's variously called the Supreme Court or the Court of Appeals, depending on you know which state you're looking at. Appeals from the intermediate appellate court to the uh, highest court uh, is usually done by permission. Uh, and that permission is granted by the higher court. Uh, there are exceptions for a small number of important cases that are selected by legislation.